to carry out a um, shoe size and frequency, we're going to be using um, statistics. So we've got a graphic display calculator. Um, so if you're at Scratchpad, you're going to click on Listen Spreadsheets, this green one down here. Okay, so click on that. You should get a uh, a spreadsheet. Okay, uh, in this top of box A, we are looking at shoe size. So I'm going to put the word shoe, and then in B, I'm going to type freak for frequency. Okay, again, I'm going to post this video in a second. So shoe size, we've got 35, 36, 37, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Just double check that I've typed that in. Yeah, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Frequency, 9, 10, 15, 17, 8, and 3. Right, so that's the, the straightforward bit. Because we've got a data table, we can put that in lists and spreadsheets. Once you've typed that in, and this is, if you're, if you're still typing in, I, I am, I'll go slowly at this point, but again, I am going to post this video. So you're going to go to menu. We're going to sneak into statistics. We're going to do a stat calculation. That's a weird, where's my, okay, hey ho. And we're going to do one variable statistics. So let me do that again. Menu, statistics, stat calc, one variable statistic. And we'll get to the wizard and it says, how many lists do we have? Well, we've only got one list, it's shoe size. So we click OK. Now it says, right, where is your data? X is our data, and we decided that we called that shoe. It says, what is the frequency list? Well, we named that frequency. We don't need a category list, we don't need to include categories. It says first result column, we want it in C. You press OK. And then the calculator does its magic and it gives us a series of values. This number here, this first number, x bar, you might have to go up to see it. And if some of you might be down here, you need to go up to see it. x bar is 37.22, which is what we've just worked out. Yeah, so we found that by doing it the long-winded way by adding up all of our data. You may notice here 2,308 is our sigma x that we've also got written down as the, the green bit in our working, 2,308. There's this number here, n is 62, that tells us the total frequency. And if we scroll down a little bit further, we've got these other values. The only other one we can use from this is the median, which is 37. Um, so if you're asked to work that out, we're either going to do it from cumulative frequency diagram or from this, okay?